Sporting clays is, is a relatively new sport. A lot of people understand trap and skeet that's been around a long time. Uh, sporting clays uh, is essentially a hundred targets that's being presented at maybe 10 stations, maybe 14 stations. It's according to how the courses are set up. But uh, you, you make a, a round, uh, much like golf. Uh, each of the shooters typically have their own shotguns. Typically those are 12 gauge shotguns and we do offer that ammunition here at the, at the shooting range. Uh, to be able to shoot a round of sporting clays is $35. That's a very competitive price as far as other facilities uh, in the region and uh, very proud to be able to, to hold it at that rate. Um, at each station you'll pre be presented uh, different targets. Uh, Zach is our club manager, is the individual who sets those targets. Zach, if you would talk a little bit about what um, determines how those targets are set and, and, and um, the difference between maybe one and the other. Okay. We're at station four here. Um, <laughs> like on this station, I have a rabbit machine. There's different size targets that I can throw. There's actually a target that's a rabbit I can throw on the ground. This one also has a standard target. They also, we also have some that are, I call them checkers. They're 90s. They're about, you know, well, probably a little bigger than a half dollar. Mm -hmm. uh, what I try to do every two weeks or so, I try to have a course change. Similar to a golf course like Ross said, instead of moving the hole, I'm moving the machines at every station. So every two weeks, the target presentations are different. It may be on the ground, it may be up in the air. We also have an 80 foot tower down there we throw uh, targets off of. But it's mostly, it's personal preference. It's just one of those things when setting targets, you have to be able to set for a novice shooter and at the same time setting for a more advanced shooter. So just throwing a good mix in to make a good sporting place course.